Hi everyone, this is Rieko. Thank you very much for watching. In my last video, we practiced Japanese alphabet part 1. Today, I'm going to demonstrate Japanese alphabet with extended sounds. There are three things that I'd like to teach you, but for today, I'm going to talk about two things. Are you ready? Let's start. First thing is about dashes. Formal way to say dashes in Japanese is dakuten. Dakuten. But for spoken language, we say ten ten. Ten in Japanese means dot. And as you see, there are two dots. So we say ten ten, like saying dot dot. Dashes are always written on the right upper corner of certain Japanese alphabets, which are kagyo, k line, ka ki ku ke ko, sagyo, s line, sa si su se so, tagyo, t line, ta chi tsu te to. And hagyo, H line, ha hi hu he ho. With dashes, this alphabet looks like this. Dashes are on the right upper corner of each alphabet. The sound for this word is G plus vowel a, so it's ga. Next is G plus vowel i so it's g next is g plus vowel u so it's gu next one is g plus vowel e so it's ge the last one is g plus vowel o so it's go you can just pronounce as I wrote under each alphabet for other alphabets. Now, here are two pairs of the alphabets which have exactly same sound. First pair is G and G. Second pair is ZU and ZU. It's exactly same pronunciation, but depends on the words Sometimes we use G on right or left, also ZU on right or left for writing. Since I just got my Japanese without learning, I can't explain the rule for it now. So Google G and ZU for now if you are curious. I'll make video to learn words which contains these different G and zu later as well. Okay, now let's go through all the alphabets on the list. Listen carefully and repeat after me. Ga, gi, gu, ge, go. Hai. Za, ji, zu, ze, zo. Hai. Da, ji, zu, de, do, hai. Ba, bi, bu, be, bo, hai. Okay, let's practice together. Ga, gi, gu, ge, go, da, ji, Zu, ze, zo, da, ji, zu, de, do, ba, bi, gu, be, bo. 
Okay, now let's practice same vowel alphabets at one time. We go through from right to left. First, just listen to my pronunciation and then we will practice together by showing my rate of pronunciation. Okay, first, listen to my pronunciation. Vowel a, a, ga, za, da, ba. Again, same vowel words has same movement of your mouth. A ga za da ba i gi ji ji bi u gu zu zu gu e ge ze de be o go zo do bo Another thing that I'd like to talk about today is sako. Formal way to say sako in Japanese, which I didn't even know until today, is handakuten. Handakuten. For spoken language, we say maru. Maru in Japanese means sako. As same as dashes, Sako is always written on the right upper corner of certain Japanese alphabets, which are only hagyo, H line, ha, hi, fu, he, ho. With sako, these alphabets look like this. The pronunciation is pa, pi, pu, pe, po. Repeat after me. Pa, pi, pu, pe, po. Hai. Great. How was today's lesson? Keep practicing by listening to my pronunciation, also by watching the movement of my mouth. I will see you soon. Bye.